Okay, the second solo is a bit longer, so I'll break it down in sections. Uh, the first section I'll do is uh, very similar to the first uh, solo and the first three licks. So I'll go over it again. <laughs> there is the same beginning with that pull off there again the second licks the same here he hits a double stop instead of just the fourth string and hammers on that nine and catches the nine on the fifth string above it so again then he goes from there Okay, the next section. Okay, so we're starting off with the second half of that last lick. So what he's doing there is coming down from 7 to 9 on the 4th string. Again, slow. One more time. Takes nine on that third string, stretches it up, and catches ten. And then does a little push up and pull off to uh, from nine to seven on that third string and catches the fourth string. So it goes like this, real slow. Does that twice. Then he does a pull off from 10, 9, 7 on the third string. And he holds that. So again. The next section will start from the pull off where the last lick left off. start this slick we're doing this again all right the next section again now the next piece section from there. Okay, we'll finish up the uh, solo here. We're going to take it from the 8 where we left off. I'll just hit that note. So towards the end of that lick, the mandolin does start, so you can pick out the guitar though because he keeps ending the solo. But anyhow, from the 8, what we're doing here is we're hitting 9, 7, 9, 7 from the 4th to the 3rd string. So I'll hit that 8. <laughs> Do that same little country lick, stretch up the nine on the third string and strike the ten on the second. Do that once, and then we lay our pinky down across the tenth fret, and we're going to play the first and second string. The next part, we lay our small finger across the uh, tenth fret, the first and second string, we're going to hit those together. And then we hit nine and stretch that up. Again. 
again. Then we'll stretch up nine and strike ten twice. And we hit ten again and do a pull off from nine to seven. Okay, and we end it with a double stop on the fourth and third string from seven to nine. Hit the seven again on the fourth string. Come up to seven on the fifth string, and then down to five on that fifth string. Okay, the last little fun thing that I'll show you is the mandolin notes. Uh, goes like this. We're going to start out on 10 and go up to 12, 14, 15, to 17. So again, 10, 12, 14, 15, 17, and we go backwards, back to 15. Then we come up to the B string and hit 10 to 12. All right, hope you guys enjoy it.